welcome back to my channel and welcome to another What I Eat in a Day to Lose Weight on WW. I cannot wait to take you guys along with me today. We are going to have such a fun day. Diesel and Lola are going to join us on this What I Eat in a Day and I just have some overall fun things to share with you as well as all of my food that I eat throughout the day, my points, my calories, all the things. So if you want to see what I eat in a day to lose weight on my WW, stay tuned. I'm sick of lying here all alone and nearly sleepless at night. I'm on mess. It's boring. One million thousand demons around me. You picking up fight. It's toxic. You were the best. So my healthy eating all the time and go bars came. I'm so excited. As you guys know, this is one of my very favorite snack bars. These are more of a meal replacement than a snack. They keep you really, really full and they are a little bit higher in points, but they are so worth it. So the my two very favorites and the ones that I always order are the peanut butter oat bar with cranberry. This one is so good. Here are your ingredients. The ingredients are great whole whole ingredients the macros are amazing i count these bars as six smart points this is what they look like so it's definitely that oat peanut butter with cranberries they really truly are so good they have great cranberry peanut butter flavor the points can range from five to seven depending on the bar I just count them all as six. And then the other one that I really like is the natural peanut butter oat bar. And this is the chocolate. And again, these ingredients are so great. The macros are excellent. Uh, because they're six points, I always use them as a meal replacement. And this one's really good. It has these big chocolate chips intermixed with the granola. Super good. I like these for when I'm on the road, especially on Friday when I go to my Weight Watchers meeting. I don't eat my meal prepped breakfast generally because I'm gone during breakfast time. So I just throw one of these in my car and when I get out of my meeting, I have a great six point breakfast. These two are my favorite. She has a ton of different bars on her website. I do not have an affiliate link. She doesn't offer anything like that. But she's a wonderful lady with a small business with a very, very high quality product. So she did give me 12% off code for you guys that basically will just get you 12% off. It doesn't give me any type of kickback, but it's a great savings for you. I'll put that here on the screen and it is linked down in the description box below. So I've been out of these for a while, so I am absolutely stoked to have them back in stock. So here is my breakfast for this morning. So I'm gonna have one serving of blueberries. Of course, that is zero smart points. And I made some avocado toast. So I have one slice of the Trader Joe's sprouted wheat sourdough bread. I have one smart point worth of avocado, one egg, one slice of Jarlsberg light Swiss cheese, and then I topped it with some of the everything but the bagel seasoning. So it is two smart points for the bread, one for the avocado, two for the egg and one for the cheese. So this is going to be a six smart point breakfast and I had coffee, so I'm going to have some water. So bon appetit for six smart points. He's the only person alive, happy it snowed. Such a weird dog. <laughs> oh yeah, happy as can be out there. So I'm gonna have a morning snack, which I'll show you next, but I decided I'm in need of another cup of coffee or two, so I am brewing currently in my little coffee pot here, the Bones Coffee and Coconut Rum. I have not had this flavor yet. I will put on the screen here my thoughts because I'm excited to try it. I did pick this up from Bones Coffee. These are the sample packs. You get to pick five flavors of coffee, and I think it's $29.99 for five bags, and this makes several pots of coffee. It is a good size bag. It's four ounces total. And again, this is the coconut rum. You get to look through the site, pick the flavors of coffee that you want, and you can add them to your little five bags of samples for $29.99. But if you use my code here on the screen, you'll get $5 off of your first order. It is not an affiliate link. I do not receive any type of kickback for it. It is just something that Bones Coffee offered to you guys if you were interested in giving them a try. So 
I love them. I will definitely be repurchasing them. I still have quite a few because I actually bought two five bag samples packs. So I actually have 10 bags of the bones, all 10 different flavors. I've loved every single one of them, but I'm currently brewing this coconut rum and I'm going to have it in my little J mug that says I am grateful for, which I love with this cute little medallion in the bottom. I got this from my secret sister off of our secret sister or secret Santas on my Facebook group. So love it. So I'm going to have a cup of coffee and a snack. And this is my snack. Oh, big shocker. I'm having a built bar. I have this every single morning between breakfast and lunch as a snack because not only is it delicious, but it keeps me nice and full. This is the coconut almond. And you guys, this literally tastes like an almond joy. So if you are an almond joy fan, you are going to love the coconut almond built bar. It is so incredibly delicious. Here is your nutritional information. So 130 calories. It has 18 grams of protein, seven fiber, only three sugar and five fat. That is what keeps you full is all the protein, fiber, and fat. And again, three smart points. It's a literal almond joy for three smart points. I love Bilt Bar so incredibly much. I have one every day, sometimes two. Sometimes I'll have this before I go to Jazzercise because it keeps me full if I'm feeling a little bit hungry, but it also with my pre-workout kind of gives me a boost of energy. So I love the Bilt Bar. I love every flavor that they have. They have literal tons and tons of flavors. They have peanut butter, which is amazing. That is the only bar that is four smart points. All the rest are three. We're talking orange, raspberry, vanilla, salted caramel, double chocolate, you name it, Bilt Bar has it. So use my code here on the screen to get 10% off and free shipping and save my code, my friends, because you can use it over and over again. Highly, highly recommend. In my opinion, the one must have on a WW journey is Bilt Bar. So this is going to be my three smart point snack paired with my delicious Bones coffee. Someone made a nest and is really cozy. <gasps> Hi, princess. Oh yeah, you're so cozy, baby. Oh yeah, you got yourself a little nest here. And this one. This crazy guy here, huh bud? Huh buddy? Oh, you're so good boy. Yeah, oh yeah, stretch it out. So here's my lunch for today. I am gonna be having something for dessert, but I'll show you that after I eat my lunch. I'm so excited for my lunch. So I have some raspberries. This is going to be my second fruit of the day. I also have some Brussels sprouts. I picked these up at Trader Joe's with some spray butter, salt, and pepper. So both the raspberries and the Brussels sprouts are zero. And then I have eight of the cauliflower bites from Costco, you guys. These are so delicious. They are one smart point a piece until you get up to eight. Then Weight Watchers Math gives you eight of them for seven smart points. So I have eight of the cauliflower bites here for seven points. So my entire lunch is seven smart points. For dessert from lunch, I'm going to be having one of my banana blueberry bars that I made in meal prep. You guys, these are amazing. Look at that. It's so banana-y and blueberry and oats, and I just top it with a little bit of fat-free Ready Whip. This entire square is only five smart points, and it is all whole food. There is no artificial sweetener. Your sweetness comes from dates and from bananas. So to check out meal prep. It was posted on Monday, so just go over to my YouTube channel. You should be able to find it super easy. It was literally just posted two days ago, but I highly recommend making these. They're absolutely delicious. So this is my five smart point dessert. Look at all the snow. Oh, diesel's back to laying in it. I have to show this to you guys. See this little pathway here? So that's our fire pit out there, those little benches. But do you see this pathway that goes from the dog door out to the fire pit, around the fire pit and back? My husband did that for Lola. He snowblowed a pathway for her because she hates the snow. So this way she'll go out and go to the bathroom rather than going to the bathroom close to the house. So so sweet so i'm gonna have a little afternoon snack so this is what i'm having so i am obsessed with these and they are a little bit high in points it's five smart points per serving and there's 31 cookies in a serving so i obviously don't want to spend five smart points so what i did is i counted out 14 of the little birthday cake bunny grams and that is two smart points I'm going to have some diet peach tea for zero. And then I'm loving these meat sticks. This entire chicken snack stick is two smart points. So this whole stick right here, isn't that crazy? It's only two 
point. I got these at Costco, so you will be seeing them featured in an upcoming video that I'm super excited about. But I'm gonna have this for two points, zero and two points, so it's going to be a four smart point snack. All right, friends, we are going to pick our winners, our three winners for my 20,000 subscriber giveaway. And we are randomly going to do this with a YouTube comment picker. So you can see here that I put in the URL of the video from last week's What I Eat In A Day with the giveaway. And basically what we are going to do is we're gonna hit start and it is randomly going to pick a winner. So the first winner is going to receive the Yvette Sportswear joggers and you guys are going to love these. They are amazing. So the winner of the 20,000 subscriber giveaway Yvette Sportswear leggings is Greta. Congratulations, Greta. If you see this video, make sure that you send me an email. It is linked down in my description box of this video within 24 hours. I will be posting this on both my Instagram and my Facebook group as well. But Greta, my friend, you just won Yvette Sportswear joggers. So next we are going to draw for the 12 bags of Smart Sweets. So here we go. This winner is going to receive 12 bags of their choice of Smart Sweets delivered directly to their doorstep. And the winner is Marilyn here, Wayne. Congratulations, my friend. Again, I will be putting all of this in the description box on my Facebook group and Instagram, but congratulations, Marilyn, my friend. You just won 12 bags of Smart Sweets. And lastly, we are going to draw for the grand prize, which is the Carrie L Meal Planner. This is the grand prize. So drum roll, please. The winner of the Carrie L Meal Planner, that is gorgeous, is Julie McGibbon. Congratulations, Julie. So I've gotten a lot of questions on my pre-workout and post-workout when I go to Jazzercise. So I wanted to show you guys what I do before and after. So before I work out, I just have Built Boost. This stuff is amazing. It is full of plant-based ingredients. All of the ingredients have zero caffeine, but it gives you literally an entire boost of energy. It has 100% of your daily vitamins and your energy is all natural. And basically it's just these little tiny packets, kind of like what you would put into water. It's just these little packets of the Built Boost. They have six different flavors. I always buy the mixed bag because I do like all of the flavors, but they have a blackberry lemonade, peach mango, pina colada, strawberry vanilla, fruit punch, and strawberry pineapple. And literally, you just dump this little package here into a bottle of water, shake it up, drink it 20 to 30 minutes before you work out, and I'm telling you, it gives you the boost that you need. And it's way less expensive than any pre-workout. And what I love about it is it does not give you that tingly feeling that a lot of pre-workouts give you. So I have one of these every single time before I go work out at Jazzercise. You can use my same code you use for Built Bars for the Built Boost. It is made by the same company and it gets you free shipping as well. So I'll put my code here on the screen and it's linked down in the description box. I believe it's $30. I think for a bag. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. You'll have to check out the website, but I love it. And this is a couple bags that I've just thrown into one. And I'm telling you, least expensive, most natural, and best energy boost that I found for a pre-workout. And then for a post-workout, I've been using this. So this one you can see is literally on its last leg. Um, I've had this for quite some time. It lasts forever and ever. And this is the Beyond Rain Precision BCAA. And basically what this is, is it's a post-workout. This is the Mango Melon. It is delicious. It's an anabolic recovery and power output. So what I really like about this is after I'm done working out, this really helps my muscles regroup and feel less sore, become less tense, and it also gives you that little energy boost or spike after your workout so that you can continue on with your day. I love it. It tastes absolutely amazing. It has 10 grams of BCAA, 2.5 grams beta power, 2 grams of velocitol, and no sugar. So it's zero smart points. The it, uh, nutritional information tells you to use two scoops. I just use one scoop in a 16 ounce bottle of water and I find that it's plenty because it is sweet. It is so good. So I love the mango melon, but I did just purchase the watermelon because I heard that this one is really good too. And look, I mean, that's a lot in there. This literally will last me 
at least six months, if not longer. And I have one scoop in a bottle of water after my workout. I'm gonna link this below for you guys. I just buy this on Amazon. Um, but I found review wise and taste wise, this has been the best post-workout. So Precision BCAA from Beyond Rain for your post-workout, Built Boost for your pre-workout. And you're set, guys. All right, for tonight's dinner, we're gonna be making the Olive Garden Zupa Toscana Soup. I'm really excited about this. I think I'm going to make some garlic drop biscuits. So I'll show those to you guys if that's what I decide to do, but I'm gonna get the soup started. So let me show you what is in the soup. You're going to need four cups of water. I'm using the Jimmy Dean turkey sausage crumbles to save a lot of time. Now you can use any other type of sausage. You would just wanna pre-cook it, but I'm gonna do these. I think it's gonna be easy. They're small, so they're perfect for soup. You'll also need some bacon bits chicken broth, minced garlic, fat-free half and half, salt and pepper, one pound of russet potatoes, baby kale, and lastly, an onion. So let's get started on our soup. So I went ahead and measured my potatoes and it actually ended up only being one and a half of these, which is one pound, and then my onion. So we're gonna slice our potatoes That'll go in this bowl, we'll slice our onion, those will go in this bowl, and then we'll be ready to start our soup. ready to start putting some of our soup ingredients into our pot. So I just have a large stock pot here over medium heat. To that, I'm gonna add my two cans of chicken broth. I'm just using what's left in this carton, which I weighed it, and it is two cans, so it works out perfectly. You can do the carton or the cans, whatever your preference is. We're also going to be adding in our potatoes. So there are all of our chopped potatoes. And we're also going to add our chopped onion. And we're gonna add two teaspoons of minced garlic. And lastly, four cups of water. So we're gonna add all of that. We're gonna let this cook over medium heat until our potatoes are cooked all the way through. Once your potatoes have softened all the way, we're gonna go ahead and add in our bacon, sausage, and some salt and pepper. So I'm gonna start here with just a pinch of salt and a pinch of pepper. Oh, and cleaning you guys off, there you go. We are steamy. And then over here, I have a quarter cup of the bacon bits. And we're also going to add in the entire package of our Jimmy Dean turkey sausage crumbles. And then we're gonna give that another stir and we're gonna let that cook down for just a few minutes. All right, once it's been simmering for about another 10 minutes or so, we're adding our last two ingredients, one cup of fat-free half and half. Oh, and I did turn my stove down to low for this as well. And then we want our two cups of chopped kale. I have baby kale, so I'm not gonna chop it up since it's pretty small as it is. And then we're literally going to just let this warm through. So you can always add a little bit more water if you feel that your soup is too thick. Mine looks pretty darn good. So we'll let this kale kind of wilt down. We'll let this simmer just a few more minutes and then our soup is complete. And I think as part of my dinner I am going to make some bisquick drop biscuits with some garlic it sounds amazing So with our soup, I'm gonna go ahead and just make some really easy drop biscuits. So I'm gonna be using the Heart Smart from Bisquick. This is just lower in smart points than regular Bisquick. And I'm gonna season my biscuits with some chives and garlic powder. And then I'm also going to use some fat-free cheese and mix it all in and kind of make like a cheddar chive garlic biscuit. So here is dinner. So the soup makes a total of eight servings. So this is one serving, which is just 
over a cup of the soup, and that is four smart points on the green plan. I will be putting the points for blue and purple here on the screen for you. And then I'm going to have one of my drop biscuits, and these are three smart points a piece, and that is on all three plans. So this is going to be a seven smart point dinner. So this is gonna be my dessert tonight. This looks so delicious. It is a parfait. So let me show you what I put in to the parfait. So first I used the Too Good yogurt. So this is from Dan and Light and Fit. This is their two gram of sugar yogurt. I really like this, it's delicious. So this is the coconut and it is two smart points. And then I did use one of my smart cakes. This is the orange cream. I also love this flavor of smart cake. It is so delicious. So these are little cakes. They are one smart point a piece. This is what they look like. So they're good size and they have this really yummy sugary coating on top of them. So I went ahead and just broke one of those up over the layers of my parfait and it is only one smart point. They're really soft and moist and really, really delicious. I love the orange. You can buy these on Smart Baking Company's website. My discount code is here on the screen. It'll give you 10% off. This is the same company that makes these smart muffins that I love and also these smart buns. So lots of good options on the Smart Baking website. And then in between my layers, I just have some fat-free Ready Whip. So it's two points for the yogurt, one point for the Smart Cake, and one point for the amount of Ready Whip. So this parfait is a total of four Smart Points. Thank you for joining me on another What I Eat In A Day to Lose Weight on My WW. As you saw, I follow the green plan. So those are my points and calories on that particular plan. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything that I ate today and that recipe for dinner, you guys, was out standing a definite must make if you are not part of my facebook group i'd love it if you would join us that is where my meal plan subscription is offered as well as a lot of support and fun and encouragement so head on over and join my facebook group there is a link down in the description box if you click the link it'll automatically take you to my facebook group and you can join that way also in the description box is the recipe for tonight's olive garden soup it was so good as well as all of the discounts that i can share with you on my favorite thing. So definitely spend some time down there in the description box. If you're new, welcome. I'm so happy that you stopped by my channel. I'd love it if you stuck around and hit that little subscribe button and the bell. That way you're notified whenever I upload a new video. Thumbs up this video for what I eat in a days and leave your comments down below. Let me know what was your favorite part of today's what I eat in a day. Thank you guys so much for taking time out of your busy day to watch my video and I'll see you next time. Bye.